So it's born to uh, crocodiles. We need to uh, shoot them. Now, sometimes the other one won't come out. If that is the case, which it looks like it's going to be, that's where to get him to come out is just to uh, yeah, go into the water then swim up and pull out here and that's going to bait him and he probably, he'll probably will now come in here which he is which is good come on there we go So, this level is quite long, but at some point that door, I think, is going to uh, close. It's below, as you can see, it's below for now, but it's going to close at some point. And we do need to go back through there. And so, first of all, coming to this uh, little crawl space under the water. There's two items in here. It's not a secret, just some pickups. And the ammo will come in very handy. <laughs> this level is quite difficult to get through, but it's not. I don't know where that my shotgun is going to be. Spider. And there we go, the spider's now dead. In the room where he just came from. box which we can shoot and claim a file of life I think it's called anyway shoot two more boxes which are both empty and pick up the key of darkness and it will show you this area which you should recognise if you uh, saw the first level of this. So we'll go all the way back now to uh, the first area. Technically this is still part of the first level, but it's just different, a different section of it. But to get back, we've got to go uh, back to where we came. And I'm now poisoned. Yes. Fight this boss poison, it's more fun. I'm going to wait a bit before... Ooh, tricky. <coughs> so grab this revolver ammo, and let's just use a uh, pile of recovery. That will stop the poison effect. We'll go back there for the revolver ammo and come through the other side, which is the way that we have to go. Well, there are two uh, things we can stand on. I don't remember which one it is, so I'm going to save. So we're going to jump to this one. No, it's the other one. I'm just 
through here today. So we'll jump onto uh, this ledge. Take a jump onto the next ledge. The running jump. Jump up to here and shimmy. At least when you save, uh, you have to redo all that again, which is pretty awesome. I did save quite a lot because uh, I'm just lazy. So run through here, and this is just the, because uh, that's the door that we came through down there. As you can see, it is now closed. we got to get behind it. Here, there, there can be uh, a bug that I've noticed where she won't grab this ladder. But we're fine today, which is awesome. We do have to do this again if you want the secret. This will get to that in just a bit. Revolver, there's going to be a huge spider. He'll get to you really quickly. That's why I, I used the uh, revolver then. So pull up and uh, head to the right. There's going to be a core space which we can. Uh, Obviously, crawl through. Now, we can come in here. Let's go into the good view. You could probably see some ammo up to the uh, right of us. We're going to get that in a bit. But first, we're going to jump onto this ledge, roll, then run and jump back straight away. We have now spawned the spider. And since he uh, can't get to us, I'm going to use the pistols. some uh, ammo over there. There is actually a secret. Actually, the better way to get to that is just up here. I'm trying to jump over to uh, a VS to the uh, right. I think actually you can pull up here, yeah. And then we're going to jump over to where the ammo is. Usually to save then reload, it gets rid of the uh, camera angle, but it just didn't work. Sometimes it works, but sometimes it just, the camera angle stays there, like it did today. Anyway, grab this secret. This. We have 
have some revolver ammo and a uh, vial of life, which is um, a large med pack. And now I have to uh, do all this over again. You can't get back uh, the proper way. Well, I haven't found a way anyway, so I just want to do it the long way. It won't take too long, so uh, yeah, just do what you did before. This is only one more level of the um, main game. However, there is a bonus level after this, which is a um, standalone download. It's called The Crash, which I have uh, already played it a bit of, of it, and I will be covering it straight away. I'm not going to um, alternate. Anymore, I'm just gonna do one at a time. Before I was also saying between this one and uh, Templar Archives, which by the way, Templar Archives has already been done. And the uh, actually, the developer of it left me a comment, which is awesome. Any recommendations you have or any theories you want me to do, just leave it in the uh, comments. This time, you can just fall down this hole, and that takes us back to where we started. And now we've got to go back. We have the water tank. So, so we're back in the water tank now. And we just gotta climb up the ladder again. There's a ladder right here which will take us all the way back up to the top. And then after this we'll never ever ever have to revisit this level again. I was supposed to point out that I did make a uh, a few errors in the last level. Uh, one, I'm supposed to use a ladder to uh, get down instead of doing that uh, banana jump. I was also supposed to use a tree to um, pull a jump switch instead of jumping from the raised part to the right. But it doesn't really matter because I still found a uh, shorter way to complete the level. And it is quite a long level this was, but well, the water tank part, the last one. Let's head up here and let's go back to our Gala's mansion. So yeah, that water tank business was very small, so I didn't bother to uh, do that separately. All that we did was climb a ladder and then ended it. With, but anyway, use the key. I'm going to save it first. Use the key in this keyhole. I just took a uh, quick break, which is why I didn't use it before I went to the uh, inventory. And uh, close it straight away. I'm just gonna. No, it wasn't yet. There are gonna be some spiders in here at some point, which are really hard to kill. Look at here, I have flare. If you will please lower. There is a uh, another large med pack. Oh, 
spoil of life. Uh, here. But technically, since there are no uh, med packs, it's just files. So technically, no med runs, but I'm not that cheap. I use some meds. I can do with that. I don't think it would be possible to uh, complete without using the meds. You can see that there is no contrast door. You need that to be closed for now. So now you want to go up to this area on the uh, on this side. You can, you can see a crack in the uh, wall. It's on the same side of, as that. There is some uh, revolver ammo right here, which is pretty awesome. And this is where I think is the uh, place where we have to use the med. I don't think there's any getting out of it. You pull this lever, two spiders are going to come out. And the mist is doing a fly by. And they, can, and they both. And by the time the fly by ends, you're already poisoned. So, yeah. I think you pretty much have to be poisoned here. But let's fight the spiders whilst we're poisoned, so they don't poison us again. And just use a file of recovery to get rid of the uh, effect. Let's save. So you want to come over to this side, just check, are we going in the right direction? I think this is to the east, I don't remember the, I'm doing this uh, post commentary so it's harder to remember what I'm doing, <laughs> but never mind. So, push the block all the way forward. And now we can go back down to lower the trap door. Is over here. Nope, it's on, it's on the other side. Just pull this lever up. That's going to release this box. Now we push it onto the trap door. This is why I have to be up. So anyway, we want to push the block onto that red tile in the corner. Not the other one, just this one. That will raise this other block. And this is how we're going to get to the key. The grids key I think it would be called, yeah that's a grids key. You can tell because on the handle it looks like it's got a grid on it. Yeah, I think a lot of these keys are called the grids key. So I think it's one of the things up this hill. Flares. I'm going to use the grids key right here. And we want to swing into that little alcove 
on the other side. Just swing on the rope. There we jump. And I didn't mean to um, grab the ceiling. So just do a fake grab and get into here. Pull the chain and that's going to, to um, open up some doors which are right here. And now we can progress. So you want to come up here and then you want to enter into a um, brand new area. So, then, so in this new area, there's going to be some um, knights who we have to kill. This one is going to drop a um, file of recovery. But let's kill the other dude first, the other knight. The other one is a complete donut, he doesn't drop anything. And actually, I wanted to point something out to you here. There is a lever right here. That's going to open up this door. But you do not need to do this just yet. But if you did run out of, um, if you are low on life, you can go back through there to balance towers just to um, fill your health bar again. But I don't really need to do that. But it's there. We will be using it and we will be needing to go through that in the next part. Because this is another area that we do have to revisit again. But this time it will only be to go to a different section of the level. Here you want to pull all five levers. Pull this lever. Pull this lever. Now before you pull the other levers, you actually want to come into here. You thought I was going to forget this. But yeah, there are some um, oozy pits back here. And that is the only reason for doing this. It's not necessary, it's not 100%. You don't have to do this, but it's easy ammo, and we are going to need it in the next level. Pull this lever. Then pull this lever. So finally pull the last lever. Let's go on in a circle pulling all the levers. That will turn all the flames on. Pull this lever. That's going to open up the trap door. So now, no Lara, don't. So just pull it once, don't, don't pull it twice, otherwise you have to pull it again. So yeah. Lara was just messing about. Come up here. And... There is a very well hidden secret. Pull the chain. It is going to um, lower the trap door in the middle. But we don't want to do that yet because we'll miss a secret if we do. What you want to do is want to push it. Onto both of the um, you put it twice here, and 
then see what Lava will say. Uh huh. Uh -huh. And then put it back onto the other one. And I think it's just the same. She says, aha, uh -huh, again. That, that is actually a clue that something has happened. We'll get to that in a minute. For this chain, it is going to love the block into this area. And you can't land on the block. But before we do anything with the block, I oh, can do it now. Press the lever. I'm going to just go down. Because I often forget this. But I think that's the wrong side. I don't think it really matters, but I think it's the actually on this side. Just think about it, it doesn't really matter. I just, uh. Yep, this has now raised, this can now climb. Unfortunately, there's no way to lower it. This would be useful. Yeah, yeah you can get down the other side as well. show you that but we do want to be on the on the um on this side because we got to go back off now and the only reason why I went down was to um was because I forget this secret quite a lot and you can see there was some um easy ammo right here I've still got one more secret to claim in this, in this um, oh, I can't say it today. I've still got one more secret to claim in this TRLE. And it is in this level. This level is quite long, but it was just about just about fit into one video so um yay let's save and now we can pull this block out you can see all the flames turned off but that doesn't matter We're going to push it all the way to the end. That will destroy the box. And we can now just cut down and leave this area. We are going to come back to it when we uh, do balance towers. But for now, if we ignore it and move on. There's a keyhole here which will. And that key is. I think the main goal of this entire level you can use the solar key right here
and there are going to be some boxes. Maybe there's an alligator. I can't see. Actually, I think he might spawn as soon as we um, step on here. So yeah, we, there is an alligator um, in that room. Which we can shoot. There you can see him. There he is. The best weapon to use would be the crossbow and laser sight. Just wait for him to come into view. There he is. Just hit him a few times. You could also use the re the um, revolver, I guess. Actually, I'm going to uh, do that. No. So, can we use the revolver and laser sight? The crossbow is, um, I think, the one that you want us to use with it. Now, you don't need to use the laser sight um, anymore. And you can go around and kill it with your proper guns. Where is he? Come on. Come out here. I'm, I'm waiting for you. There we go. He is now proper dead. Which means he won't bother us. And because we're cowards, it's a lot better to shoot him where he can't get to you. A bit of a lag then, but ignore that. So, we'll see if here. Yeah. So, if you do have any uh, recommendations, like I said, just leave them in the comment section below. Here is the torch that we just dropped. Also, be a link to um, download this Sierra Lee below the video. So I'm going to uh, light that torch and come. So I'm going to take it to where we, we will be needing it next, which is over here. I'm going to leave it there because that is where the next place to use it will be. Now this place, I'm going to save. So let's slide down the slope. Grab the key. Swim out. And then come up here. They kind of uh, so now it's time to get the last secret. Don't touch the floor here, because that will set you on fire, which is bad. So don't do it. I'm warning you. Come up here. Backflip. This is probably probably um one of the best hit secrets. I know I've uh, not found it. It's not very clear that this is climbable. Just shimmy along. Don't let, it's a lot faster if you if you don't let her get a footing when she's going to the left or to the right. So now. We have the 
damn thing. That's when it jumped over. See, I got caught on the uh, fence there. Another way you can do this is to run and jump up this slope and then jump back. As in that can be another way you can do this. So uh, if I cut this, I'm going to do the same thing again. So yeah, I'll do the same thing. Come here, jump back. And notice how you can't go across that because it is a slope. You want to use, you want to cut here. You grab the shotgun ammo, and now we can go back this way. This will take us back to um, the same area. As you can see, there's the campfire, and we picked up a key which goes right here, and this is where we'll get the um, spooky music. <laughs> so yeah, just grab out the torch. Throw, throw the torch down for just a sec because you can't um, crouch with the torch. I am going to use a flare here. Usually, I wouldn't use a flare if there was a torch nearby. Unless I have to. It's also quite dark, so the torch is doubly useful. So, light this torch, it will give us a bit more light. Under here, there is some uh, crossbow bolts. Or oh, there are some crossbow bolts, should I show? Like this torch. And just throw it. There is a uh, note, and uh, let's let's read that note. It says according to our research, it seems that the, that colours that wrong, and symbols are lined together in a logical and arithmetic way. Two colours are combined to make a third one. So I guess I'll try the path that carries out the orange colour. Now, um, being British, that spelling of colour is um, not the one that we use here. And since uh, I think the designer of this is French, but you know, I'm not going to bother with the spelling. Off his head, yeah, but and it is supposed to be a um, U in colour. If you're from Britain, C O L O U R. I guess if you're American, you're going to be confused at that. What I'm saying, but never mind. Listen, we we, did, we put the U in colour like they do in Canada. I think. So when you got this key, the skeleton wakes up, but we already shot his head off. So... There's going to be another skeleton that comes out, I don't see him. There he is. Come on. Shoot. Shoot his head off. There we go. Now can just head out. We don't need the uh, torch anymore. We can just leave it where it was.
So, what we can do now is with this key, we can use it in this room. Let's get open after this door. So, what we want to do here is tap into the water. Now, that clue that I just read out will be used at some point. But for now, pull this lever. And there's another lever in this area as well. So come up here and just pull up. Pull this lever and that's going to lower that. It's also going to release two alligators. So they are going to go uh, and ignore the lever. For now, we will be pulling the lever, just not yet. And they both took some serious damage. That's okay, but we will use a med pack. When we get out of here, so let's, get, let's go about a uh, pile of life. And no, don't go out the crossbow, let's go out the shotgun. Leave of us without worrying. And there we have it. There is another area you can see down there, but you can't swim through it. It's the current. But anyway, there's a uh, ladder there with a keyhole. There's also a door there which we will have to open. There's another ladder right here that doesn't have a keyhole. So come up here, pull this chain. That's going to open up one of the doors. We'll open up to this. We'll open up the door in the middle. Which has some sort of colour map. game just a uh, black boss tech but that doesn't really matter I just rolled and went straight forward and this trap door opened uh, go to the blue one first then it's the um, red one I believe blue and red make um, orange, which is what that clue was telling you about. I go for the purple one this time. I don't want to 
Oh, best day ever. Oh. Yeah, on this ball right here. Then it's the uh, wall with only one lever, which I believe. It's time to um, swim. No, it's not. No, it's time to head back and swim back the way we came. It doesn't now. It doesn't matter which doors you go through now. But if the walkthrough says to go through the blue door followed by the red door when you first go in. Okay, we did. So now put that up here. And we now have a key. This key is going to give us access to the top. So climb up the ladder, because now the uh, trap door has been lowered. We're going backwards. So pull up here or jump backwards, whatever you want to do. And climb out. You can see that there is a rope. So we're going to jump out the rope. We're going to just swing forward on the rope. Oops. Never mind. Let's do it again. There we go. And pick up this Aussie ammo. Not the Aussie ammo, shotgun ammo. I'm getting tired now. This is a very long level. Very long level. To pull out two level three classes, only one of them is removable on each side, and it's this one. And you want to push it onto the other three red tiles. And then push it onto the fourth one. So push it all the way forward. And we push it onto this next tile. The um, flame goes out. So you can push it onto this. Now, that lever, lever, sorry, is going to pull, it's going to invert four trap doors. Two of them on this floor, and then two of them below us. And then get the goal of this area is to get the crosses on the main floor. So pull, probably the back up again. And Let's put the, put the crosses onto the uh, trap doors. So we can 
get them down to the main floor. Just push it all the way and uh, it will fall down. And then before we ever leave that, which will invert the trap doors again. So the cross is now on the floor. Just to show you. It's on the floor now, which is where we want it. So first this other cross. Onto the other trap door, and then we'll put that on the floor as well. So when both of these are on the uh, floor. We can push them a bit more. So before we start, and carry on down. Push this cross all the way out. And onto the uh, electric tiger blue bolts coming out of it. Onto this one, after the other one, onto the uh, bolt tile on the other side. So Young turn to come. Where is Izzy coming? Oh, it's got unstuck. Gone. There you go. Go over here. Wait a few seconds and then we're going to jump. I can just wait for him to come over to me, but it doesn't look like he's uh, coming. Come on, I'm waiting for you. Mm. I'll just shoot him into the water. And he can do the same thing with this cross. all the way out uh. if I push it once too far I just push it back once if well uh. I'm going to have to push it back once because I pushed it too far, but never mind. 
push it onto the uh, pile right there. And that will release another skeleton. Let's do the same thing. Run over to the water and knock him in. Sometimes he goes round the long way and uh, if it happens just try and make him jump. So this door now opens and we get another key of darkness. Which we will take back out of this area. All these rooms have a purpose. And now they can finally leave this area. So, so uh, most of these areas, the whole goal of it is to get a key to get out of it. So use the key of darkness right here. and save. Goodbye.